Hey guys, it's me, Bernie Burn. Welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be ranking my top 15 favorite FNAF songs. Now, this video was inspired by Freddy Pop Collector. I'll leave a link to his channel down below. He covers FNAF stuff, so yeah, go check him out if you, if you want. <laughs> uh, but yeah, on to the list. So coming in at number 15, we have Circus of the Dead by Try Hard Ninja. This song is alright. <laughs> it's catchy enough, and it's alright. Definitely deserving of the number 15 spot but certainly not as good as the rest on this list. At number 14, we have Survive the Night by Mando Pony. This and the next one on the list are probably the two most iconic songs, for me at least, from when FNAF was just starting out. So that they're not, they're not the best songs. They're catchy. It's just they're iconic. So yeah. And then number 13 is Fun Time Dance Floor by CK9C. I feel like this song is kind of underrated. It's not that good, but it's underrated, definitely. It's a song about the fun times, mainly Fun Time Foxy, which that on its own is cool. Him slash her and Ballora are the two from Sister Location that get neglected the most. But yeah, Fun Time Dance 4 is it's good. I don't want to use this word too much, but it's catchy. So yeah. Number 12 is Five More Nights by JT Music. Again, just like Survive the Night, it's iconic for me, and it's catchy enough. So it's good i feel like survive survive the night didn't get number 13 because it was just i i heard it too much five more nights it's good number 11 is they'll find you by griffnilla again this one's catchy enough it's iconic it's good so that's why it's number 11 that's really it <laughs> coming in hot at number 10 is the fnaf 2 song by the living tombstone memes aside <laughs> it's a good song it's not really that good lore-wise, but that shouldn't really play a factor in it. It's a good song, so that's why it's number 10. Numero 9 is Like It or Not by Daco and CJ5. <laughs> CJ5. CG5. This one is just, it's, 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 a, it's a classic. All of Daco's songs are good. Minus his ultimate custom that one, but we don't talk about that one. Yeah. Like It or Not, it's a, it's a good skong, skong, song. It's really catchy. I would say 9 to like... Six are all really good, then five through one are just really, really good. But yeah, Like It or Not is it's a classic. I, I just really like it. Coming in fresh at number eight is the We Are the Phantoms remix. Now, the original We Are the Phantoms, it's okay. Oh, I, I, uh, it was made by Axie, CG5, and Swiblet, by the way. But yeah, the original one, it's okay. It's a little slow and a little bland. And all it has are uh, eight bit sprites of the phantoms which is cool and all it's just the remixed version of it is better in my opinion it's a little more fast-paced it feels like there's actual animation so i really like it and it's freddy pop Quarter's intro and hearing that a million times really makes you like it <laughs> but other than that it's a really good song so that's why it's number eight number seven is break my mind by da games the fnaf four songs on this list are just so good da games is so talented and break my mind is just it's so cool it's really all I have to say. It's a good song. Number six is the FNAF 1 song by The Living Tombstone. It's it's classic. It was good back then, and it's still good today. It, it still holds up. So, yeah, it's iconic. That's all I can really say. It's a good song. All right, now we're entering the zone of really good songs. We got number five, Into the Pit by Daco and Dehust. It's just so catchy, and it... I don't want to say it captures the story well it does a good job of summarizing it kind of it's just a great song that's all i can really say Daco and de Houston, they are a match made in heaven no homo but their songs are fire at number four we have labyrinth by cg5 there are tons of great youtubers and musicians in it like Daco's in there i think da games is in there it's just so good and it this one really summarizes fnaf 6 in a nutshell Especially with that ending, uh, with Henry, it's just so cool. Labyrinth is really, really good. So yeah, that's why it's number four. All right, three more left. Join us for a bite, I Got No Time, and Darkest Desire. Coming in at number three, through one is all three of them. I cannot choose. I know that was very anticlimactic, but they're all, they're all really number one. I can't choose. I love them all. Darkest Desire, not only is the animation great, but it's it's not as intense as Break My Mind. 
but it's still so good. Especially the parts with Glitch Trap. Phenomenal. Join us for a bite. It, it's probably my favorite Sister Location song. It kind of captures the feel, like of the story, but even though it doesn't really, it's still a great song. It's, it sounds nice, the vocals are nice, it's just a great song, and I Got No Time by The Loving Two. Oh yeah, uh, Darkest Desire was made by D Daco and D. Hughes. Joyce Bite was made by JT Music, and I Got No Time was made by The Loving Tombstone. I Got No Time, it, it just it just really captures the crying child's or Michael's or whoever we play as their determination to survive through this and then, you know, they get bitten. <laughs> but yeah, just I love all three of those songs so much that I can't choose my favorite. I literally cannot. Maybe I Got No Time would be third. But then I couldn't choose between Darkest Desire and Join Us For a Bite. Join Us For a Bite's just a classic and Darkest Desire is new and it's, it's fresh. And I, just, I just love them all. So yeah, very anticlimactic, I know. But I can't choose my favorite between those three. That's it for my top 15 favorite FNAF songs. Let me know if you guys agree or disagree or what, we, what you would change or keep the same in the comments. Yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.